Hi everyone. Today I would like to teach you how to do single stitch crochet. Here, if I can get it right on camera, you can see that it's a really easy stitch. Um, to do this stitch, you would need to do a chain first with your yarn and your crochet needle. You can use any weight yarn. I'm using like a medium weight yarn right now. Um, and you can use any type of needle. First thing you need to do is chain link. It. I'm doing the swirl method, of course. Um, I'm gonna do at least three. And then I'm going to do two for height. Every, in everything you do in crochet, you need to do a chain to start your, um, your line for the height. First thing you do with the loop on the hook, you take your crochet needle and you go into the loop on the um chain right here i'm going through the front to back you go front to back front to back you take your needle go front to back i want to show you that go like this front to back okay take your yarn swirl or you could just like um do this. You could just do this too. Just do this. Pull through. Take another one, piece of yarn and pull through. Both of your loops. I'm going to show you that again. Get your needle. Have your yarn. Go front to back front to back okay front to back take your yarn get a loop and pull through get another piece of yarn and pull through both of your loops as you saw I'm going to show you all that again in a little better of high def. I'm going to turn around and as y'all can see, I'm making single stitch crochet. I'm going to, the loop on the thing, right, is on here from the one that you pull through in your crochet needle, right? You take your crochet needle, right? You go through, you see what I'm doing? I'm going through the loop right here on top you pull through right that loop you're gonna pull through that but you go front to back okay front to back when you want to turn over then you you turn your work but you go front to back okay I'll show you when we do the other side front to back right and then you take your piece of yarn right Put it on your needle or your crochet hook. I also do cro um, knitting, so that's why I got needle wrong. Sorry. But you put it on your hook. You pull through once, right? Then you take another piece of yarn and you pull through. Pull through both loops. And there you go. A beautiful row of crochet single stitch as you can see now on the other sides we're turning our work right we're doing this side fun part you on this side what happened was you had uh, your yarn from behind right now you move the yarn to the front you make a chain one two for height like I said for, before, you always do it for height. 
what you're going to do, take the, the crochet needle. You go through, you can, eat, you can either go through both of these loops on the top. If you can see it well, loops on the top, you can either go through both or you can just go through one. I'm going to go through both, as you can see. Um, you go like that. You bring, you put the little thing in front. You go, do. I think you turn. You, yeah, you keep the the piece of yarn in the fr front of you, and you take a piece of yarn. This is why I kind of loop it like that to help me be able to pull it through every time but sometimes it doesn't work so that's what i was just trying to show you the 